Okay, we're here with uh, Robert Morris, all-time leading point scorer and uh, current Chicago Wolves forward, Nathan Longpre. Nathan, uh, thanks for coming up and supporting the Colonials as we take on Niagara tonight. A couple questions for you. I guess first off, uh, it's been a long time since you've played a game for Robert Morris, and it's been a very interesting time for you. Talk about uh, probably the biggest thing for you, the uh, Vancouver main tryout camp and scoring a, a point in, the, uh, in an NHL preseason game. What was that experience like? Well, um, coming up to uh, that point in the, in the summer, um, I got a call in July uh, just detailing um, I was invited to the, the Penticton rookie camp, um, Vancouver's camp. Um, it was just an unbelievable experience. Uh, I got to stay in Penticton for a week. Um, I played three games, one, one against Edmonton's prospects, Calgary's, and uh, San Jose Sharks. Um, you know, it's just unbelievable being uh, coached by Craig McTavish um, um, and the, the other um, coaches of Vancouver. It's just unbelievable um, the knowledge that they gave us, um, the opportunity that I was given, and it's just I'm honored to have partaken in that in that experience. And then, uh, obviously, last year you played a couple games with Worcester in the AHL. Now you're with Chicago. How good did it feel when they uh, when they offered you that contract to come play full time? <laughs> it was just the weight that's been lifted off of my shoulders. Um, no greater feeling uh, being accepted and um, signing a contract with an AHL team. Um, a lot of players look towards this as a career, and I got lucky in doing this. So I feel greatly honored. And, uh, you know, I put a lot of effort into this. Uh, this is what I want to do, so I wanted to keep keep doing what I do and keep on doing what I'm doing. Now, what, in your opinion, what's been the biggest change from uh, college to the pro game? Um, I'd say the structure of the game. Uh, in saying that, the idea of more system-like than college um, that I've found. Um, if you are not in position for um, what you're supposed to do on the ice, then if you're beat, then that's a great chance for them to score on you. So it's just all about positioning and where you see yourself on the ice. Um, you know, I've played 20, 28 games a season, and it's already feeling like I've played a college season. <laughs> now you guys are on the break right now, coming up in the second half. Uh, what are you looking forward to, and what are some of your personal goals? Um, well, starters, we have a great team this year. Um, we're showing a lot of promise in the latter part of the year. Uh, I think we we have a good chance of going far. Um, Calder Cup is what we are trying to attain, but um, saying that my goals are to stay in the lineup, um, just keep working as hard as I can. Um, I guess keep putting points up. Last one for you. Obviously, you personally had a lot of success at Robert Morris, and your team had a lot of success at Robert Morris. What's what's kind of the defining? What, what do you take away from that? What's your? Uh... Well, I had I had some good players to play with, like Denny Urban, Chris Kishnerik, Brock Meadows, Scott Colby, um, just to name a few. Um, but my most defining moment was. <laughs> I don't know, there's a lot of good moments I, I shared with a lot of players here. Um, we never got to win a championship here, but we came close a lot of the years. I think our, my most defining moment was sweeping Miami. Um, that was a great moment for our program and a great experience for us. Um, I guess that, yeah, that was the most defining moment. Thanks for joining us and good luck the rest of the season. Thank you.